let's do a full face of pink honey starting off with the eyebrows i have got the honey glue and then i have got the wonder whip as well as the spoolies so let's give it a whirl starting off with the honey glue i'm just going to pop a little bit of setting spray in there and make a paste and then what i'm going to do is just swirl the spoolie round to just get a gorgeous consistency and now what i'm going to do is just layer this onto the brows and stick them down so that is with the pink honey glue and then that's without like oh my god string the brows are giving snatched now we're going to go in with the wonder whip in medium brown if you're looking for a good pomade this is amazing i'm just going to take an angled brush and i'm just going to pop this into the eyebrows i'm not going to draw a full brow because i don't want a scourge brow i'm just trying to fill in the white areas can you see the difference i think they are looking good i'm going to go in with a wipe and just wipe around any residue that's on the skin and i'm just going to literally go around the brow so there's no glue so using toffee truffle in the bff face frosting if you follow me you know the score i absolutely love this stuff and with good reason why i love this how gorgeous is that undertone and these are the places i tend to put my contour just because i feel like it's more flattering for my face shape and i'm just blending this out with a hf cosmetics brush and this is the hf 14 brush this is amazing it's like cap or if you haven't got alan's bundle yet get it because it is a stunner then i'm going to take the pixie pen in the shade thailand's treasure and i'm going to try and do a little bit of a nose contour i am terrible at nose contours but this actually does make it a little bit easier so i'm just going to do it on the tips of the nose and underneath and then a little bit across and blend that in i'm taking a small blending brush that's how i'm going to blend that in and hopefully it looks like i've had a nose job <laughs> Then I'm going to go in with the pink camo concealer. This is in the shade Golden Gun. If you are a similar skin tone to me and you wear false tan, etc., this is such a gorgeous under eye concealer. And um, the shade is just oh, stunning. You'll see now. So it is a pot concealer, so it is a little bit more coverage as you would with a wand. And I'm just taking a MAC 252 brush just to apply underneath the eye area, like this. As you can see, a little bit goes a long way, so do use sparingly. I'm just buffing out that concealer now with a small fluffy brush. Then we have Path to Peach um, Cream Blush as well as it comes with like a little highlighter. But for now, I'm just going to use the Path to Peach Cream Blusher. How stunning is that shade? It is beautiful. I want to add a little bit of the Flush Fluid in Grapefruit Glow on top of that blush because I feel like it will give mwah, perfection. I'm just going to take a P. Louise sponge and just add that on. I'm going to pop one of the eyelashes on that pink honeydew. I have got um, a mixture of them. So I've got Ivy, which is stunning. Then we have got Daphne. That is beautiful. And then we have got Adeline. I love Adeline, but I think I'm going to go with Ivy. I'm sorry. Look how gorgeous them Ivy lashes are. They are stunning. And this is everything pink honey on my face. I am absolutely obsessed with the brands. Let me know in the comments your fave product.